a Tennessee teen inspiring folks across the country this morning, proving anything really is possible. His hard work, his determination under the most difficult of circumstances. Earlier this month, 17-year-old Tupac Mosley graduated as his high school's valedictorian, a 4.3 grade point average. He's been accepted to more than 40 colleges. He's earned some $3 million in scholarship money. All of this while dealing in the recent path with the loss of his father, with becoming homeless earlier this year. Tupac Mosley joins us now. It's great to have you with us. Uh, I know you have gotten a lot of calls, a lot of people wanting to talk to you, wanting to express how inspired they are by everything you've achieved. Could you put into words for us, what's it like for you to see all of these people and to hear from them and have them tell you how inspirational you are? It's definitely an overbearing feeling of having so many people message you, call you, text you to say how I've inspired them with my story. And it's honestly an honor and a blessing that I was the individual who could inspire others with my testimony. You, uh, you set some pretty high goals for yourself, even just getting to the point, uh, as we said, you, you were worth more than $3 million in scholarship money, but you had set a goal for yourself of a million dollars in scholarship money. That's a pretty high number. Yes, ma'am, it is. I've been trying to do the best for my school, so I've actually wanted to be a million. Once I made it to a million, I want to make it to two million. And I actually did not know that I received three million until graduation. That is a, um, that is a huge load off, uh, as you know, for anyone who is setting out uh, on this path to higher education, who's going to college. We know how expensive it can be. What does that change for you to know that you don't have to worry about much of the financial aspect? As I've been worrying about finances and money for most of my life, mm -hmm. to know that I can be doing something that I'm enjoying for my next four years and really going into my career or starting my career off is, for lack of a better term, just refreshing and motivating that, mm -hmm. all right, I'm going to do this with confidence. I can do this with confidence, not having to worry about anything else. You talk you talk about how you've, you know, you've had to think about money. You've struggled with finances for much of your life. Um, earlier this year, in February, I think it was, um, you became homeless uh, at one point, living in a tent. Yes, and, and, and throughout all of that, you still had the focus um, for your studies. You were able to get to this point. Where did you find that strength? A lot of people say that the strength came within myself, but I honestly would like to give more credit to all of those around me, all the people at school, my family members, my friends. They have all been a great support to me over my past um, four years in high school and knowing that they stuck around this long and really being there for me when I need them the most. They've been their encouragement. Well, uh, I would imagine that they are not going anywhere anytime soon. They will be with you through these next four years. You are heading uh, to Tennessee, uh, Tennessee State University, majoring in electrical engineering, and we look forward to seeing where you go next. Tubac, yes. thanks for taking some time for us this morning, and congratulations. All right, thank you.